Hi guys, I hope you're doing well. Today I want to talk about and share about something that I'm a, a little bit ashamed about the fact that I hadn't had these conversations with our son Thomas earlier. So last night we were, um, or yesterday evening, we were driving around and I was getting some things for um, a project I needed to finish up. And we were in the car on our way to McDonald's. So we have openly, or at least somewhat openly, talked about to Thomas and just everybody else that we do not feel led to stay in the Philippines for a super long time. And the adults in our life know that once Misty is adopted, we are going to move, excuse me, move back to the U.S. And so last night while in the car, Thomas made the comment, he said, we're going to go see, we're going to go see Nana tomorrow. And Sissy's going to get on an airplane with us. And that just, I, I explained to Thomas, I was like, oh, that just, that hurts my heart, you know, that we can't do that. And so then it got me thinking about the fact we haven't really explained to, excuse me, we haven't really explained to Thomas that who he affectionately calls Sissy has to be adopted first before we can travel, before we can go see Nana and Papal. And um, it got me thinking, like, I don't have any books on adoption. I've got a lot of books on disability because I really felt led to collect those this summer. And so I was looking through YouTube and there's not really anything that I have found yet that explains, um, you know, Thomas's point of view. Thomas is biologically ours. Um, but with having him in a different country, like we still had to do paperwork and things to be able to travel with him. But in order to explain it to him and, 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 and Sissy, in the future, like, he's asking questions. He's at the age where he's asking lots of questions. And so, excuse me, I need to be prepared and ready to answer those to the best of my ability. So, the way I explained it last night, or at least tried to, was, Thomas, you know that, um, you look like mommy and daddy, you are biologically ours. And he seemed to understand that somewhat. And I said, well, Sissy came into our family a different way. Sissy had the situation where, for whatever reason, you know, she wasn't able to stay with the family that looks like hers, the, the family that looks like her, the, but, the family that's biologically hers. And so God worked it out so that she came into our home. But in Sissy's situation, there's a lot of paperwork that has to be done and has to be completed. Um, I explained it like, you know, as he has homework and lots of schoolwork he has to do, well, there's a lot of paperwork. Um, there's a lot of papers that have to be signed in order for Sissy to stay with us. And it goes from one important person to another important person to another important person until they finally say, okay, you know, you've, you've done all the work. Now, now Sissy is yours um, forever. And so it, it seemed to satisfy his questions, but it really got me thinking of 
one, I need to get some children's books in our library or in our home library that talk about adoption, um, that talk about foster care, because he will probably have questions down the road about the kids that we, we had um, in foster care that we didn't, that didn't stay in our home. And so I wanna be able to answer his questions the best I can. I wanna be able to answer Sissy's questions. <laughs> in the future, you know, I, I wanna be able to, to meet those needs of, of knowledge growth and, and that kind of thing and so but it was really good that you know he's up to the point that he's asking questions and he knows and understands that sissy is in our home to stay that we love her that she is his sister and um i think he understands now that we're not going anywhere until we can make sure that she can go with us and so do I think I explained it the best way possible? No. Do I wish I had help in explaining it? Yes. Um, I do know that there's other resources out there. So I, I need to do my research and I need to look into that. But yeah, I just, I wanted to share that he's, he's asking questions along that way. And I, I wanna make sure that I'm able to best answer them. So I would really appreciate your prayers with that. Oh, so, excuse me, yeah, guys, I've been tired today, but, yeah, we're, we're still on this adoption journey, many of you ask, you know, constantly, do you have an update, do you know anything, no, no, we don't, no, nope, no, <laughs> and so, we don't, but, it's, it's neat that, um, we have a, child that is invested in knowing and, and loving his sissy, his sissy as much as we do. So have a great day and we'll see you next time. Bye. God bless.